Mark chapter 11 has some very profound words of the Lord Jesus. Um, when he goes on to say to his disciples that um, when you pray for things and you ask things from the Lord, you are to believe that um, you have received it. Believe that you have received it and it will be yours. The thing is, the Lord Jesus, in this case, is not simply saying, believe that you will receive it, but he's saying, believe that you already have received it. Whatever you ask in prayer, believe that you have already received it. And I want to encourage you guys out there, concerning a companion you're waiting for, a spouse, or anything else in life that's important and needful to you, the question is, you're praying for it, you're asking for it, but have you actually believed yet? Not that you're going to receive it, but the experience of faith in this particular thing is so deep and profound and wonderful that you feel in your heart you've already received it. That kind of feeling. It's just a case of waiting for it, the right time for that particular thing to actually happen. So I want to encourage you, that if you're simply praying, that's great. But if you can pray as the way the Lord Jesus says, that you actually believe with all your heart, not simply that you're going to receive it, but it feels as if you have received it, then that's even better. And the Lord will do wonders for you because faith makes that thing that's far away a reality right now in your life. And you will be living an experience and a joy and a wonder that the Lord has heard and he's going to answer that prayer and he's going to do wonderful things. And you'll be able to rejoice in that and you will glorify the Lord and he will bless you for it.